Hey guys, Fit Future MD here. Today I'm here to talk to you about choosing your fitness goals. Now, first off, you have to choose whether you want to lose weight, gain weight, you want to be a bodybuilder, you want to be a power lifter, you want to be a fitness model, do you just want to be overall healthy? You know, you have to choose what fitness goal you're going to have. And once you choose a fitness goal, you're going to have a 6 to 20 week plan, you know, depending on what goal it is, you know, and you're going to adjust that plan based on how it's going for you. Basically, you can't be an NFL lineman and do the same things as a fitness model because you just won't get there. You know, so whatever your goals are, you want to choose a plan to get yourself there. So how do you choose which path to take? Well, first of all, you're going to look at your genetics and your family's genetics. Okay. So if you are a five foot two, 105 pound female, you know, you're not going to be an NFL lineman. You know, genetically, it's just not possible. You know, now, could you be a gymnast absolutely you'd be the perfect gymnast you know so you just have to choose you know figure out based on your genetics what you want to be for instance i'm 6'2 and when i started my fitness journey i was 302 pounds you know so my goals were a lot different than somebody who's 5'2 105 pounds so now you've chosen what you want to be whether it was a fitness model bodybuilder power lifter you want to be a professional athlete you just want to be healthy you know most people just want to be healthy and live longer life so now you have to assess or even learn you know what it's going to take to reach that goal and whether you're going to be willing to sacrifice to make that goal. For instance, if you just determine you want to be a bodybuilder, you know, it's going to take years of discipline, eating six to eight meals a day, going to the gym every day for years of your life, 24 hours a day, seven days a week. You know, your time is going to be spent on that. And you have to figure out whether that's going to be worth it for you or not. You know, is that going to be a viable goal? Whereas living healthy, you may eat three to four meals a day. You know, and go to the gym three or four times a week. You know, do cardio, lift weights infrequently, you know, and just eat right. So it just depends on what you're going to be willing to sacrifice to reach those. So goals. if you're five foot seven to five foot ten, you know, your whole family's five foot seven or five foot ten, and you all stay under ten percent body fat year round, no matter what you eat, you may be a great candidate to be a bodybuilder or a fitness model. You know, but someone that's Six foot two, 300 pounds, 40% body fat, and the rest of the family is 40% body fat. It may not be a viable option to be a bodybuilder. Maybe a viable option to be a power lifter or an NFL lineman or a professional athlete. But bodybuilders are between 5'6 and 5'11. You know, most bodybuilders are not over six foot. You could be a uh, famous movie star. They have six foot six movie stars, you know. So it just depends on what your, what your fitness journey is. You know, your genetics are going to depend a lot what your fitness journey is going to be. So guys, choose your fitness goals wisely. You know, I, right now I want you to think about what those goals should be. Um, in later videos, I'm going to go through each goal and describe exactly what it would take to reach those goals you know i'm going to talk about what my fitness goals are and how they've changed in the last three years 
you know, because I've been in my fitness journey for three years. And how they could change for you over time as well. For instance, if you're a 400-pound person, you may just want to lose weight. But once you get to, say, you get to 200 pounds, you may not be, you may not be satisfied with the way you look. And there may be another way um, to adjust and your goals may change. You know, so you should tell me down in the comments below what your fitness goals would be. And make sure you like this video, subscribe to the channel. I'm off to the gym.